Ladies and gentlemen, here we are. So we're going to be playing a little bit of Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale while I talk about two new things that are going to be coming soon to Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale as well. It's some really exciting stuff. Hopefully you guys will enjoy this video. If you do, be sure to go and smack it a like. That would be awesome. As well as if you guys are new around here, be sure to go and subscribe. And whoa, that guy actually has a pretty cool parachute right there. So he actually got kind of lucky with his drop. I kind of wish I... Oh, you know what? There's going to be two people. Okay. So we got some health and then a gun. Ooh, nice little AK. So I definitely need that ammo. I'm totally down to go and push that area. And actually, this is my first game of the day as well. So we'll see how my accuracy will... <gasps> oh, Definitely got him a little bit there. Whoa. Whoa, my aim went super weird there. Oh, nice. Okay, got that guy right off the bat. Hopefully he had... Oh, an MSMC. I'm not a big fan. Okay, I'm going to swap it out for the Cheekomb. I'd really like to know, what do you guys think about the MSMC in Battle Royale now? I, I don't know. I'm just not that big of a fan of it. Because they did recently add it into this mode here. I'm just not a... I'm just not a really big fan of it. The recoil is super crazy, something that I personally cannot control, but I know a lot of people do love it in the multiplayer. And here, let's use my specialist, see if anyone else... Oh, there's going to be two people around here. So don't worry, guys. We're going to be getting into uh, all the new things that were just revealed to us in a little bit here. I just want to be sure to go and get rid of these guys, and hopefully I can go and explain it a little bit more in depth here. But the guy is definitely going to be around here. Maybe up the stairs, I'd have to imagine because there was another guy that did uh, drop I'm pretty sure I think this is like a really good spot here if you drop up in these uh, buildings and oh RPD oh this is actually my first time uh, going and getting this so this was also just recently added might as well just swap that out for my AK there yeah dude dude I'm totally down for this this should be interesting oh so I heard footsteps I don't know if those footsteps are up here or if they're gonna be Ooh, another level three vest here okay we'll call in my specialist again there was definitely two guys that got censored up somewhere here and i'm pretty sure the guys like maybe below me I, I don't know oh no oh oh no oh no he's reloading oh god thank god okay <laughs> he could have just annihilated me there he was pretty much just standing right here just like all right come up <laughs> And also, the best thing about Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale is that you can just do this, and ooh, you can survive. Okay, nice. Let's go, man. So there's some more fighting going on over here, but we might as well start off with the first thing. So it would appear that a truck is going to be coming soon to Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale. You guys are actually seeing a screenshot of it on screen right now. And it's not going to be a military truck, kind of like what you guys are seeing on screen right there. It's going to be a full out like military truck driving around. I'd have to imagine you could just ram right into people and just... It would be cool if with trucks like that, if they were an instant kill, if you managed to go and run someone over but it's definitely something that i'm really looking forward to it's crazy that they're having all these updates to the game oh we got a guy right here get oh oh send it oh my gosh she just i just sent him to the moon okay goodbye my friend dang let's go but going back to what i was saying it's kind of interesting that they're adding in oh hold up Oh, that guy tried to use the flash on me there too. Let's go. Okay, there was also a helicopter that was just randomly flying around. But okay, going back to what I was saying, like this game only being available in Canada, Australia, as well as Peru, and they're already having all these crazy updates to the game. Dude, it just makes me so happy because if you guys can just think about the future of Call of Duty Mobile and what it's going to be like, this game is going to be absolutely huge. I can see consistent updates and it's, it's weird because Call of Duty as just a franchise isn't known to give players a lot of free stuff and like constantly update their game. While with this game, it feels like they're going to be kind of breaking that mold and making something that a lot of people can go and enjoy. So that's something that I'm really looking forward to. And also, we'll plan on driving to Pipeline. But there was one other thing that I wanted to go and mention here. Let's actually hop out. Oh, whoa. Okay. <laughs> I'm good. 
Oh, but there's still an upgrade thing over there, so I'm actually going to go and hook that up. And while I go and do so, I want to announce the other thing. So, a couple days ago, I made that video in which I talked about the two new classes that are going to be coming soon to Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale. And you guys... Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, he's right here. I was like, who's shooting at me? Where is that coming from? Oh, nice. Twinkle Toe Jam was this guy's name. That is quite the name, my friend. And he's trying to crawl back to his friends. No, thank you. But a couple days ago, I did make that video in which I talked about... Oh. <laughs> I just could not get a chance to speak right now. Okay, there we go. Oh, and my RPD is low ammo too, but okay, finally, going back to what I was talking about, I made a video in which I talked about the two new classes that are going to be coming soon to Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale, and you guys are actually looking at those classes on screen right now, but there's also a little bit of information that we got more specifically on what these two classes do. So for the Trickster class, you'll be able to produce two projected glowing holograms that will be able to go and confuse the enemy as well as the passive ability will be that you can hear enemies footsteps easily in a wider distance so it's definitely an advantage that might be good it will be interesting to see how the audio will sound from those footsteps i can see how it can be somewhat overwhelming like just constantly hearing footsteps but i wonder if that will be a class that will i don't know rival something like my scout class here because it's not really an aggressive class to go and use but still nevertheless it's definitely interesting i'd love to know what your guys's thoughts are on that and then for the second class here which is airborne you can use a catapult to catapult your team and they can glide to wherever they want so this is kind of like octane from apex legends and oh here we go oh we got a, like a full team oh no they see me or maybe or maybe they were shooting at someone else oh all right, got one guy. Oh, that's behind me. Oh, all right. Where is this? I see you. Okay, what is going on right now? This PDW is such a laser. I wonder what attachments I have. And I'm pretty sure there's still some other guys that are going to be in that house over there. And then I got to get rid of these zombies here. Get out of my way, zombies. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. All right, <laughs> we should be, we should be good here. There we go. Also, let's heal all the way up to 150. So I don't know if there is still going to be a guy in this area. You know what? I can actually use my specialist to see, but <laughs> that that was interesting. That was a fun little time there. But going back onto the new classes here, going back to Airborne, it's kind of cool because for the passive ability, you can glide faster with the wingsuit. So I would say Airborne is definitely an aggressive class to go and use. If you want hot action, you want to jump right into the action, like ironically there, you can go and do so by just throwing down this catapult that will be able to not only catapult you, but your team as well as you'll be able to go and glide down a lot faster. So I'd have to imagine, especially if you're planning on dropping into a hot drop zone. Whoa, where is this guy shooting me from? Oh, no. Whoa, okay. Like I said, I don't know what... Okay, I really have to check what attachments I have on this thing, because it is putting in work right now. And I just picked up a foregrip here, too. And also, a little bit more fighting over here. Let's just use my adrenaline syringe while going over here but i will say this the airborne definitely being able to hear footsteps is a huge advantage that's something that's super huge oh two people oh i see one of them oh baby all right i did put some shots in that guy there's gonna be some guy who's gonna be closer right here oh that guy is so weak okay rpd action oh there we go all right, and then, oh, whoa, 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 oh no, oh no, okay, I'm just gonna, oh gosh, just gonna fall back just a little bit, we'll heal up, I'm at 47 health, I don't know if he's gonna be planning on pushing me here, but dude, that guy put into, oh, I see him, yeah, he's right behind that little barrier over there, okay, let's maybe plan on reloading this, and then we could... Maybe plan on looping around and finding him. I just want to reload my RPD and then we'll plan on pushing this guy. So I know exactly where he's at now. Oh, he was maybe even... Oh, no, I see him. Okay, let's maybe plan on uh, pushing him. He's probably think I'm going to be... Whoa. 
Oh, here we go. Oh, no. Oh, and he got me. Dude, if it wasn't for that little interfering thing, I would have been able to get out of there. I didn't know that's what the ability does. I, I don't know what the class is called, but whenever you go and throw out that little drone thing, it will like mess with your aim and you can't even shoot. But ladies and gentlemen, in terms of these two classes here, I'm really excited about this. It's going to be interesting to see what the future of Call of Duty Mobile will be, not just from introducing these new vehicles and just classes, but just like for the game in general. It's just going to be so awesome. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to go and give it a like. If you guys are new around here, be sure to go and subscribe for future Call of Duty Mobile videos, as well as feel free to go and check out any of the other videos that you guys are seeing on screen right now. But with that said, my name is Parker. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful and fabulous day because I certainly am. And I guess I'll talk to you guys in the next video.